once you've clicked on spark view to start the program next thing to do is click on build a new experiment then it will ask you to choose a layout the best one is to use the full screen layout and we're going to probably use the graph but first of all we need to bluetooth and connect our devices so first thing that we do is connect to there and on the smart cart if you long press the on off button okay you should start to see it flashing okay flashing sort of here ready to connect okay and then we go back uh, to spark view and hopefully we start to see a device connected then eventually might take a bit of time one of these comes up okay and hopefully yeah, 863125 is the same as the number on here 863125 uh, so that's the one i connect to you may at this point get a little message saying that update the firmware please don't do that you don't need to update the firmware okay now you're ready to start okay and you can choose the graph and when we do so we now select the measurement we want and we're going to choose on this in this particular case velocity okay um, and you'll see it tells me initially the velocity is there at zero i'm reading 20 uh, readings per second once i press the start button now if i press the start button okay uh we'll see it takes a little bit of time to get going but if i now move it okay we can start to see that it is working 